Welcome to our day. What's up everyone? It is a rather beautiful Thursday afternoon. Heading to the post office to check the uh, mailbox. And then I have an important uh, pre-tax preparation meeting to head to. It'll be lots of fun. I also need to mail this cool little Cube Plus camera to the gentleman who won it all the way in Ireland. All right, wish me luck. Least favorite part of the year. Going down right now. Oh. Well, at least they have complimentary coffee, you know? Whoops. I told you it was a, like a pre-meeting uh, because I, I kind of wanted to get a specific checklist of the things that I need to bring in to do my taxes because like I've got 1099s. And the main thing is like the house because I'm not clear on what this year means as far as taxes when we become homeowners this year. It's different when you're renting or buying a home. And I guess you can write off the interest uh, that you pay on your loan, but because of like how we're buying the house, we're not sure who gets to claim that interest. So. That's what I needed to figure out. Well, it appears as though I've gotten all my running around done just in time to get Colin off the bus. He should be here any minute, actually. What's up, dude? Welcome home, dude. Hi, Dad. How was school? Awesome. Yeah, awesome enough for a lollipop. <laughs> what is this? Yeah. I come home and you guys are sitting here absorbing season one. Of The Walking Dead? Uh-huh. The Walking Dead resumes this Sunday on Valentine's Day. Eat your heart out, zombie lovers. I can't wait. I had another idea. Something else I want to do tonight is... It's kind of clever, and I'm going to make a video, but I'm not going to post it on my YouTube channel. I'm going to put it on Facebook where it belongs. I'll tell you more about that when we get to it, but I think you guys are going to like the idea. It's pretty genius, if I must say so myself. There's nothing like waiting till last minute to get the kids Valentine's stuff for school. Huh. So Colin decided he's just gonna get all of these, 18 of these, for his classmates. 18? Mm-hmm. I guess there's 18 kids in his class. There's 21 in my class. There's 21 in your class? Oh my goodness. I know, right? But yeah, as you can see, this place is loaded with Valentine's stuff. Never fails. What? Every time we go into a store, boys have to use the bathroom. Uh oh. They're all gone. You don't have enough. Let's <gasps> see about these. No, there's plenty more. Here, let's pick this up. Carson is counting out his. How many you got? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. 16. How many do you need? 21. We're here in the store and we ran into Colin's best friend Riley. Um, so I got to meet her mom. That was nice. And hopefully soon we can have a, a play date or something. Or sleepover. And they can play. Sleepover. No sleepover with girls. Sorry. We also need some construction paper to put on the outside of their boxes. All right. I think we got everything, right, boys? Yeah. Carson, what are you doing? I also get I get two packs of sweethearts because I'm one of that 18 students. Alright, I think we got everything we need. Now let's go home so we can build the boxes. You got the glue? Glue. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Carson's trying to pull I'll off a creeper them. head. I'll, I'll cut them. For his box. Are you sure you want to do that? Yeah. Let's see what Carl Collins doing. He wants to do a dragon. Oh wow. It's pretty serious. We're gonna have to cut many, 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 many squares. Colin, come here. <sighs> many, many painfully tedious tape pieces and paper later. And we've got a green covered box. 
I know what you're thinking. Come on, Gail, the craftsmanship could be a little better, but you know what? This thing will be thrown away shortly after the day's over. I'm having Carson. I did the hard part that required all the cutting and taping and all that. Now cut all these squares. So there's light green, there's dark green, and there's white. You got it, Carson? I need more. Are you going to get this? Are you going to rock it out? <laughs> Come on! Earth to Carson? What? You're like full on focus mode. Look at these dresses. Oh, they're <laughs> prophylactics. 100% prophylactic dresses. <laughs> wow. I bet that'd be the safest prom night they ever went to. <laughs> it's coming together. Dad, can you get some more squares for me, please? Yes, sir. I got you covered. Okay. Hey guys, so we're about to go to bed. Yeah. And are you ready to go to bed, Dad? I'm not ready to go to bed yet. But you have school tomorrow, so you have to go to bed. I'm ready for bed. And are you ready for bed? And we have a Valentine's party tomorrow. A creeper head. What are you doing? Hey, what are you stuck in here? It's my turn to show you my box. It's actually not unfinished yet. Yeah, it's not finished. All I have is just the sweetheart candy in it and just like wrapping around it. Right. I still want to put like like hearts around it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you yeah. can do that. Yeah, like around the mouth. He's baby. Transmission? All right, guys, I'm ready to do it a bit now. Good night. All right, guys, I'm ready to go to bed, too. I'll see you in the morning. Night. And a lovely morning to you. And to you, sir. Look at this box that Mommy did, man. She went, she went nuts last night. She's got the mouth with the teeth on it. And this dragon's got wings with the tail. That's sick. Now we're just waiting for the bus. Can't yep. wait for this Valentine's party. Are you excited for your Valentine's party? Mm-hmm. Yeah. It starts at one. Starts at one? Mm -hmm. Oh, make sure you tell your teachers happy Valentine's Day from your mom and dad to you. Okay. Doesn't matter, you know, teachers are like second parents to your kids because they spend so much time with them. Yeah, they spend seven hours with them. Seven hours a day. I know. Not only to Colin, but to Carson too. What if home is? Oh, Carson's there. What? Oh, Colin just missed his bus. That's what happened. <laughs> Colin missed his bus. Now I'm gonna have to take Carson. What up, homies? <laughs> what up, homie? No, Carson gets on the bus here, and I gotta take Colin to school. <laughs> have a great Valentine's party. I love you. Love you too, Daddy. Love you. You're coming. Got it? <laughs> okay. You ready? Yeah. Here's your little uh, Valentine's love dragon. He's all safe. I hope you have a fun time, okay? Okay. Make sure you give out all your special Valentines. Okay. You Tell him about Riley. You guys remember the time when he said he was getting bullied at school by the girl? Well, what happened with that girl? She's now my best friend and she said she loves me as a friend. <laughs> See? Things can turn around. Alright bud. Love you. Love you too. You know, I have a theory about this coffee. Let me show you what I mean. I ran out of my Folgers coffee this morning, and so I bought these for like emergency backups, right? Javalia, it's just medium uh, blend coffee. But, and I already opened one and put it inside this container. I don't know if you can see it real well, but this coffee is really fine. Like it's very finely ground, right? Normal Folgers coffee isn't quite as finely ground because 
the majority of, I guess, extraction methods for that coffee is the regular, like, drip coffee maker. I will say that normally when I have Folgers coffee, I can drink about three to four cups before I start feeling Aww. juiced, you know what I mean? However, with this stuff, I've only had like two cups and I feel like Superman. So I had this theory like, does finely ground coffee absorb into your bloodstream faster than more coarsely ground coffee? I feel like, personally, the finely ground coffee gives you a much quicker caffeine absorption than a coarsely ground coffee. Yeah. I don't know. You guys should experiment yourself. All you coffee drinkers out there, I want you to make a pot of your normal coffee and then try finely ground coffee. You gotta be careful not to get all kinds of grounds in your coffee pot though. Let me know what you come up with. Alright guys, so today's vlog was a bit uneventful, but you know what, you have you have days like that. We had a we had to get the kids some stuff ready for Valentine's Day and and then of course taxes. Today I kinda have a lot going on. Um, my mom's having surgery on her knee today, so I need to go and help her get into the house when her surgery is done. But before that, I'm gonna go, I gotta drive to the hospital, hang out with her and my dad while she has the surgery, drive back to my mom's house to pick up my grandpa to take him to a doctor's appointment at 3.30, and then have Dallas... And yeah, so it's just like a lot of helping out the family while they're taking care of like medical stuff today. Um, and I didn't get to show you my idea for this video series that I want to try and create for my Facebook page. Um, well, I want to try and shoot it tonight. I have the setup like I had to come up with a way to get like overhead shots. We'll try that later tonight. I'll keep you guys informed. Just make sure you come back tomorrow for some more awesome, fun, cool Gilroy stuff. Uh, so that's where we're gonna leave you guys for today. I wanna say thank you so much for watching and we can't wait to see each and every one of you right back here tomorrow. <laughs>